Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Monday, a beautiful, beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in celebrity news, y'all. Brad and Eva, this story is for y'all, honey. It's being reported that JT, y'all, from the City Girls, is showing off her brand new edges, honey. Now, they're saying, y'all, that um, the popular female rap star, y'all, recently underwent a medical procedure to transplant new edges on her head that has her looking like Laurie Harvey, honey. Now, they're saying, y'all, that the procedure, which is called a Hugh African American hair transplant is designed specifically to restore black hair, particularly y'all, in the front of the head and restore the hairline. Now, they're saying prior to this um, hair transplant, they say if it didn't work, it usually didn't work for black women, but they're saying the curly nature of black and our African-American hair made the transplant more difficult to do than for Caucasian or Asian hair. Now, they're saying that the hue African-American hair transplant, however, y'all, uses special technology, y'all, that works on black hair, and they're saying that the procedures is exploding, y'all, in Los Angeles and in Atlanta, and it has many black women, honey, rocking Laurie Harvey-esque baby hair, y'all, and people are saying she looks amazing with this. Can Laurie Harvey should go ahead and patent the baby hair look, right, because that's her style. Black women wouldn't wear baby uh, hair we until Laurie Harvey came. We wearing baby hair before my mama was born. Oh, oh yeah. where the term came what from is saying? from babies. Where do you think it came from? Joseph well, why are they saying um, everybody's looking like Laurie Harvey, they're saying that Laurie Harvey is the one who got to look at and women are trying to look like her with the baby Just hair. Like they look. say Bo Derek created braids, Gary. Yep. Maybe, maybe the baby should uh, sue. <laughs> Somebody should sue because, honey, I mean, this is something. Do y'all have edges? Y'all got y'all edges? Um, I have, braids? yes, we have edges, yes. oh. Gary. And babies oh. should also sue the baby because <laughs> he's not a real baby. <laughs> okay. and, and they should also Lucy? sue men that call their old lady baby. They own rights to that. <laughs> Well, honey, I tell you what, these girls are getting this baby That's happy. good for her, though. That's good for her. Just like people get boobs or get whatever they want done. If she wants to fix her hair or fix her teeth or anybody want to do anything to themselves and they got exactly. the money, do it. It ain't well, tricky if you got it. Why not? Why from alopecia. But what made the baby have different... such a big boom all of a sudden? What's the what deal? What do you mean? It's what do you not mean a new people want to have edges? It's not a new thing. Well, well what's so much I about edges? I remember Gary. Gary. What? Edges baby hair, hair has been style. a thing since. Yeah. Since the beginning of the 90s. When I used to do baby fat fashion shows, Kamora Lee Simmons used to make sure she swooshed our baby hair before we walked down the runway. Baby hair is not new at all. Uh, We've been doing this. Oh, well, I'm just telling you. Selena did baby hair. Come on now. I need to get that baby hair from up under some of these women's chins. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, you're looking like Teddy Pendergrass. Ryan, you're looking like Rick Ross. <laughs> 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 Your mom around here talking about some uh. Uh, uh. I'm moving on, child. Moving on. In other celebrity news, y'all, Tristan Thompson, y'all, they say he threatened to kill Lamar Odom, y'all, for flirting with Chloe. Now, they're saying, y'all, you know, Tristan and Chloe broke up on a couple of weeks or so ago because he was cheating again for an umpteen time. Well, Lamar, she put a picture out in a little bikini, you know, when a woman of um, non-African descent put a picture out in a bikini, men go crazy, in particular African ones. So, honey, he put a, she put that picture out, and Lamar, honey, commented on it, and Tristan was living, saying that he wanted to beat him down or what have you and stuff. What did but, Lamar say? What? Honey, Lamar Honey, he said, um, first of all, he said, play it if you want, honey. He said, different results. He told that to um, Chloe because, honey, he wants her back. And, you know, he'd been dating. The last few women he dated were, were not um, financially sufficient. So he was dating Carly Red and um, what's her name? Miss Parr. So he Your trying friend. to get back with Chloe. So mm-hmm, trying to get back with Chloe because so, Chloe I don't got think her money. The Carly Red thing was a real situation. You don't think so, Fred? You thought that was fake? I we told it's you it wasn't we, real. We they were just it. seen in a picture together. And yeah, then all of a the sudden show. they were dating. They were mm. just together yeah. in the same place. Right. Well, if I didn't get it from them, I don't care what y'all said. But, um, hey, so anyway, don't right. you date Benzino? <laughs> Huh? Yeah, um, oh, that's um, real old. That's real old, Ricky. <laughs> oh, really, Carly? Oh, oh, Ricky. Oh, 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 man. Since then, <laughs> since then, he done had a baby with another. Uh, what's her name? Althea? Oh, Lord. Oh, yeah. Come on, y'all, baby. Ricky. You, you just nap. behind. We're going to have to put you up on what's going on, Rick. Mm-hmm. It's been an old episode. He was okay. crying over Carly real Red. Old. <laughs> <laughs> but she had that BMW. No, Carly <laughs> Red is supposed to be dating Lamar now, but that's what we're telling you on the show, Love and Hip Hop, on the, on the uh, advertisements and stuff. You see that, but I don't think they're really dating i don't think it's real i uh, will put you up on everything rick just hold yeah, on i man. need to 
Well, that's okay. not good to say that that's not real because on the show it was real, Brad. So we got to go. No, by they never said the they show. were dating on the no, show. It just oh, appears did. that way. We it told you that picture. already. We, it, yeah, I said oh a lot God. of things, but it didn't manifest. But anyway, <laughs> um, so I just guess. Uh, congratulations. <laughs> really, what you say don't manifest. But uh, congratulations to um um, um <laughs> But why? I need help though. Why men they date a woman then they throw her to the wolves, but then we should give another man. Then you want to fight behind her. You wow. throw her away. Jealousy. Is that what Who it is? Who threw her away? I, I think she Tristan broke up with him. For, uh, uh, no. He's talking about Tristan. Tristan we threw went um, back. Um, <laughs> Chloe away, honey. So, he did, he and now he wanted back because Lamar wanted. So, but he anyway. Threw he threw away. He made a few mistakes. I'm sure he didn't stop loving her. He didn't throw her away. But you well, know, if you ain't with her, you cheating on some damn body else, you don't love me. <sighs> that ain't okay. true here. Okay, That's Gary. not true. Sometimes people just have yeah. problems, Gary. Y'all people have character have, flaws. It don't even matter for y'all to even try to correct Gary. He's going to think what he want to think and say what he want to say. <laughs> you damn right because he threw her away. Oh the color of the no, day, honey, is not. one of my favorite colors. My color of the day is midnight sun. On the high end, you say midnight sun. And on the low end, just say beautiful sun. black. That's your color for today. Sunshine. Y'all, give it up for Gary with the D.